Hello everyone, and welcome to Dynamics 365 Portals Tips from Engineered Code. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 16. Please use site markers. One of my pet peeves is seeing hard-coded URLs in a Dynamics 365 Portals project. Whenever I see this, it typically means the developer is not familiar with site markers. The portal capabilities for Dynamics 365 is a content management system. This means that it is totally possible for an administrator to change the URL of a page. Developers need to be aware of this and to take it into consideration when they are developing their solutions. Site markers allow you to set up a reference to a page that an administrator shouldn't be changing. It's a simple entity, essentially just a name and a lookup to a web page record. But when used correctly, it will make your portal's implementations much more stable. There are a number of built-in site markers. For example, search, profile, and page not found. In this tip, I'll use the search site marker to illustrate my point. When you enter a search term into the portal, you are redirected to a page with the URL of slash search. Now, if we go into Dynamics and modify the URL of that page, you'll notice that when performing a search, you are automatically redirected to the new URL. This is because the functionality has been developed using site markers. Instead of using the URL of search in the code, a site marker called search has been defined, which references the search web page. Then, the code asks for the URL of the page associated to the site marker. So if the URL of the page changes, the code still works. So next time you're about to hard code a URL into your portals projects, stop and please use a site marker. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found Dynamics 365 Portals tip number 16 from Engineered Code on site markers useful.